afternoon, Southwest Florida. This is an April's Herald Lunch Break. I'm Janelle Simmons. Today we have fresh headlines from your favorite presidential hopeful, Kara Knightley's Brave Broadway debut, and more. Today is Tuesday, October 6th, and this is the Lunch Break. Just when you thought you couldn't get enough Donald Trump, he's back on the airwaves, this time defending Second Amendment rights. Trump attended a rally in Nashville over the weekend where he commented on last week's shooting at an Oregon community college. Trump said that any attacker would be shocked if they tried to assault him, implying he would emulate 1970s action star Charles Bronson's vigilant film Death Wish. Trump criticized gun-free zones, claiming the shootings could have been limited if instructors or students had been harmed, and said better mental health care could help curb future shootings. Here's to hoping that Donald Trump won't have to channel his inner Bronson anytime soon. Pirates of the Caribbean star Kara Knightley recently made her debut on Broadway as the lead in the play, Teresa Raquin. Her first performance in the bright lights was married by a heckler who shouted at the actress and threw a bouquet of flowers at the stage before being escorted from the theater. Knightley did not break character throughout the commotion, proving her acting chops once again. Check out our website to learn more about Knightley's Broadway debut. If you don't live near Broadway, the Naples Players is a new show you can check out right here at Sudgeon Community Theater. Back for its 14th season, the Naples Players Excedra Readers Theater is opening on October 18th with It's About Time. The program features three one-act plays that will be performed in the 2 by studio at Sudgeon Community Theater. Excedra Readers Theater gives actors a varying experience the chance to perform on stage, gaining valuable experience in the bright lights with an interesting twist. The plays will be performed without the lines being memorized beforehand, props or blocking, limited rehearsal, and the actors will perform in black costume. Check out NaplesHerald.com to see which plays this year's players will be performing. Curtains up at 2 p.m. That was the lunch break for today. I'm Janelle Simmons. The lunch break airs Monday through Friday at 12 p.m. right here at NaplesHerald.com. Thank you for watching. We'll see you tomorrow.